One minute remaining for this round one of boxing. Ginhawa Dolor! Ginhawa Dolor! This morning is a really, really important morning, guys. Uh, it's going to mean a lot to me personally because I need to prove my worth to somebody and show them I got game. But first, we're going to pull over a new rotunda here and get two things. Give me that thing! Red. What's up, man? What's up, bro? How are you? Afternoon, bro. Brad, I have a... I need help. That's so funny. No way. That is hilarious. Boding seems, uh, seems like a bit of a legend around these parts. The stickers everywhere. That's so funny, man. <laughs> okay, I got my coffee. I'll show you in a minute. This is random, but they're selling artwork all the way down the road here. Uh, never seen that before. It's pretty cool, but I noticed something at the end that I have to buy. Brad, how long are you, Brad? How long is it? Okay, this one is 80 bucks? Okay, probably two. All right, Kalamai, Dua. Pulas. What's up, bud? What's up? What's up, yo? <laughs> I got the iced white coffee. Getting fired up. This is what Commander Dao got. Supposedly, I had mine less sweet. I also got a second two coconut shells full of Kalamai from Hagna Bahal. If you look back eight years ago, I actually learned how to make this in Hagna. This is going to be a prize for Buding if he can defeat me at what we're about to do. Let's go to the big abandoned, not abandoned, destroyed building that's undestroyed now and turned into a school, I think. Let's go. This is interesting, the first time I've ever been in here. Uh, I think I have to go second floor. We're looking for Boding. Ah, sports zone, right there. This is really creepy, it's like pitch black. Um, I don't think you can see me. I feel like this is like The Walking Dead and a zombie's gonna attack me. Grab you and creepy. Red. Red. Dude, that is, that is freaking terrifying, man. Dude, it's like The Walking, it's like The Walking Dead. Seriously. Yeah, I started running up the stairs. All right, the vlogger, the vlogger is vlogging the vlogger. This is it, voting. This is it. What's up, bro? Hi, man. John, John. John, nice to meet you, bro. Woo! Okay, I gotta let him do his thing. I gotta breathe, dude. That was really scary. That's, that's what it's gonna be like all day right there. Get used to that feeling, bro. Get used to it. Oi. 
Okay, I'm seriously still going through heart palpitations. And, <laughs> and, it's, and I went to the coffee place, Cafe Sadala, <laughs> and I realized, Boding, are, you're so famous, bro. Your stickers everywhere. From Kagai. Want to see this? Check this out, Boding. Ready? Before we warm up, look at this. Look at this, eh? I can talk to the cam. Oh, shoot. If you, this, is, this is how you know you're really good. You do the flip. Ready? Eh? Like this. <laughs> Look at this morning, all day long, baby, all day long. Jesus, <laughs> Maria. <laughs> Alright, warm up. Ping pong, warm up, the challenge. Is that what we're doing? Yeah, yeah so, Hello. so, so, so. Uh, whatever you want, so if you want to get to, to not, not go to, to the boxing, yeah. you will. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, be sure now you will not one lose of table tennis. It's so hard to mix for oh, three rounds. Man. Uh, seven, Do not do pick toss against this guy. You gotta go full on top spin serves, right into the body. Okay, it's 28 in game two. Budding's really good, but I have I have potential, Diba. Oh, oh. Yeah? Serious though? Serious? Oh. Okay. You have your potential, Nalan. <laughs> because I'm gonna lose this game, I'm just gonna hold this for this point. <laughs> hold up. Action shot. Wait, wait. Oh, why did I touch it? Oh, oh yeah, he's That's gone anyways, right. okay. Okay, down to nothing. Until, until, until Basaya, until Basaya underdog. Underdog? Yeah, like, you know, like, not, not very good or expected to win. Uh, but underdog is... Uh, is it like in the, like in the log beer? Yeah. yeah. Like in like in a cockfight? In the log beer? The I'm the beer. Beer! 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 We're doing best of five. What do you mean last game? I'm gonna win the next two. Maybe. Okay, what's the ball? How does that work? Bro, what's gonna happen here? Uh, we'll see how your car works. Is it really tiring? Uh, yeah. Depends. Super. I lost to Boding, so I have to box. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, but it was 21 17 in the fourth game that you didn't really see on camera. That was pretty cool. That's the consequence. <laughs> That's the consequence. consequence of your actions. <laughs> okay, three. I feel it. Okay. okay. Well, slip. Slip. <laughs> I was like, I was like, I was like, but that's dead. Can you do the docking just? Don't do this. Time. Make your body uh, square. Remain this square. body square. Okay, just slip again. Okay. okay, then always look at your opponent. Okay, so slip, slip. slip. Oh, uh, okay. Always look at Brett. Always. It's like your Brett. <laughs> Okay, it's Mavic, Mavic. Mavic. When you come back, when you come back, baby. Okay, now, <laughs> slip. There you go, then. Okay. You throw one, two. For, uh, for now, you just throw one, two, four. Oh, wait, okay. One round. Okay. One, two, only, and then. One, two. Yeah. One, two. Okay, just remember your footwork. This is unexpected boating. Uh, I just lost the boating, so I got a box. But it's about time I do a bit of boxing in the Philippines. Come on, baby. Come on. Uh, uh, you should experience that, you know. One of the pride sport in the Philippines, Mr. Manny Pacquiao.
seconds remaining for this round. <laughs> Then you say, para sa'yo ang laban na to. <laughs> para sa'yo. Para sa'yo. <laughs> ang laban na to. Para sa'yo ang laban na to. Ben Maverick, if you ever set foot in Philippine soil again, we're watching you, bro. <laughs> slip, slip, da, budut. <laughs> <laughs> They, they, uh, mostly after clients, but after office hours. Ah, that's why I'm measuring out It's 100 pesos an hour for a group to rent the ping pong table and then just jam out. The last game I almost had Boding, it was so close. I hope he puts it, he was vlogging it, I hope he puts it in his vlog. That was good, I got better. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. The truth is, guys, I'm actually, uh, my two competitive sports in Canada were I'm a goalkeeper for a soccer team. And, oh, you didn't go, you're right. Done. Later, Brad. Later, guard. Later. Guard, guard is a very Kagiyanan thing. Guard means bread. Um, I was a goalkeeper in soccer and I played competitive volleyball. Uh, but when it comes to ping pong, it's been a while. But I'm, be I'm better now. Take me yeah, three games. Four, four after five games. Oh. What's yeah. the What's the actual history of this building, bro? What it's happened? Just, uh, like it was gonna be a school. No, before yeah. before Sendong. It's gonna be a five day. It is pre-Sendong. Yeah, be, before Sendong, this is gonna be... It's gonna be before Brad. <laughs> oh, he's selling crabs. Sorry, Brad. Pohon, pohon. Tuna paksu. Tuna paksu. Sweet and sour fish. Sweet and sour. Chicken in the soul. Chicken in the soul. Pinakpe. Torta and talong. Torta. So this is called a modern carinderia, but I'm going to call it a social carinderia, even though the prices aren't social. It's totally affordable, but hello, Chef Mitch. Hello, friend. We're actually friends with the owner of this place. Uh, she's super cool, and the food is super awesome. Definitely worth coming to. Um, I want to tell you something interesting. I'm just going to call him Coach now. Coach told me something about Samar. What did you tell me about Samar, Coach? There are two people in Samar. Every Filipino should know this one. There are two kinds of people in Samar. Some are good and some are bad. That's <laughs> true, man. You go there, there are two kinds of people there. Some are good and some are bad. It means what, like, what we do is uh, we pick a fruit and then we crush the ice. Put the fruit in it, then come. That's a good... You know what, we're actually having this discussion. Boding, would you agree that ice candy is like the original Filipino-style ice cream? Because you just grab the fruits or whatever and huck them into uh, with some cream and stuff and just freeze it in your freezer. Yeah, that makes sense, but... And like from the 70s or 60s, I think, we already have this ice candy. Uh, here in Andrea, anyway. Anyways, ice candy looks good. Chef Mitch will eat. Open the tablet. Woo! Open the tablet. Open the tablet. Boys, we have two things to do right now, okay? Number one, bro, coach, yeah. what's the moon joke? Uh, do you know who's the first man in the moon? Yes, Neil Armstrong. No, it's a scam. What? <laughs> Before Neil Armstrong arrived there, there's already a man there Who? sitting. What? When Armstrong talked to him, hey, what's your name? I'm Abul Anun. No, 
Ah, Bulanon. Oh. The people from Bohol. Yeah. Yeah, yeah Bulanon. Like that, they're Bulanon. Oh. Oh. Okay, okay. <laughs> Okay, I get it. So I get it. Island. That's why when you go there in Bohol, they like they like calamari. It's a circle thing, just yeah. like the moon. <laughs> they have stars here. The eyes look like moon. <laughs> the first man in the moon are Bolanon, not Neil Armstrong. It's a it's a scam. <laughs> the Bolanon. Yeah, that's a good one. Yeah. That's a good one. The Bolanon are the first okay. man right there in the moon. The second thing, we're gonna walk down the street. To a place called Purple Yam because Bodin told me it's the new sea cat ube yeah. cake. Is this true? Ube yeah, cake. Ube cake. I'm gonna buy some ube cake for Via Hero and because it's my right there. Oh, it's like dope. Purple Yam. There it is. Oh. I am in the cake house. What's my difference? Everything is everything the same? What's the inside difference? Oh yeah, what's up, what's up, what's up? Um, what's up, is everything the same? Is this all the same? What's the it? It's all the same? Okay. So it's purple cakes. Let's get some purple cakes. You guys want some purple cakes? Ikaoba. No. Okay, I'll buy you a cake, coach. Ikaoba. Sigi. Oh, you're doing your bossing stuff? I'm a, I'm a soaking here. Brad, Brad. Brad, what's up? Brad, what's Hello. Hello, Chagia. Hello. Hi, Kula. Hello. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. We got three ube cakes and a chocolate cake. What's up, Brad? What's up? Okay. That place supposedly is super sea cat because they even sold out yesterday, which was a random Wednesday. So they told me at Christmas time they were selling 700 cakes a day. Oh, Gabi and Boding. Gabi and uh, Boding also goes here just to get the little moist cake <laughs> yeah. cups. They sell little cups of ube cake. It's my. It's literally just two types: ube cake and chocolate cake. But uh, most people just go for the ube cake, you know? It's like the sika. Last December, the line of the uh, the line of the you know those. Who ordered or the customers there? Yeah. The purple yam. Really? <laughs> Went to the old Kanba sports zone. What? The, yeah. They, they had a line. Yeah. They had a yeah. line? Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna go bring some cake as well to Via Hero. I'm going home, coach. Thank you. Yeah. Boding. Boding is going to marry hot dog. Brad, what's that? Yes. I guess. Yes. Right. Yeah, Siggy. I'm gonna take a photo with that guy. And all right. Hold it, hold it. Siggy. Rock and roll. Siggy, Brad. Drive safe, bro. And ping, and ping, ah. And ping. Brad, ride safe. Take care, bro. Boding's heading to the east coast, so I won't see him anymore for a few days. But love you, Brad. And ping, and ping. That was uh, super awesome. Just good days in Kegi and Dioro. Gonna go home now, bring some cake to the Via Hero staff, and yeah, see you in a bit. This is like, it's the same thing okay. Knows. Let's clarify this one more time. The Eric and Reina are super smart when it comes to history in Kegi because they're involved in tourism. That big building that looks partially destroyed um, but is now turned into a university was actually supposed to be a Hotel Riviera resort yeah. mall mall convention, convention center. center. Yes. There's going to be a separate building for a mall. Okay, separate building for a mall, but it's supposed to be a convention center resort along the river. Sendong hit, yeah. all the investors pulled out. Another thing, why is that circle called Rodelsa Circle? Go Reina. It's named after Rodolfo and Elsa Pelaez, the owner of the school, Liceo. Yeah. That's why it's Rodelsa. So the Palaez family owns yeah, Liceo. Yeah, yeah. And they're a prominent family in Kagan Dior. Mm. Okay. I've seen their names on signs before. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. that's why I'm saying that. And when I think once was a vice governor before or something. Vice president. Vice president? Vice president, but a different. Of the Philippines? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay, a little bit level up from vice governor. <laughs> okay. Grab <laughs> Anyways, there you go. That's the history of the building. In the meantime, 
Eric's writing a whole bunch of things down because he's planning the most extreme future of awesomeness for this place I'm currently sitting in. Right, Eric? No pressure. You're gonna make the most amazing thing ever. Yeah. So, uh, wait and see. Wait and see. Wait and see. Super interesting. Uh, it looks like that whole rotunda is supposed to be a massive mall and hotel project. I'm just reading about it on the internet. Uh, there's an article in 2016. Uh, it says it was gonna be an 18 story waterfront hotel with infinity pool. Now we know. Uh, what else happened? I got smoked through ping pong today, but I had a wonderful time. It's great to see boating. It's great to, <laughs> the jokes. So fun to do boxing. Uh, hey, I'm in the house. So many memories in this house. But I have some big news about this place coming very soon. In the meantime, something that might make you laugh. I ordered a whole bunch of this. Hong Tai. That's the, uh, the inhaler thing that we all use in Catio that the boys introduced me to. Oh, I can't open it with one hand, sorry. But you breathe it like this. Hong Tai, you just buy it on Lazada. Um, 99 pesos each, but you want to see something that made me laugh. They sent me a free gift. Snail white whitening soap with 10 times intensive whitening. Again, this always makes me laugh because uh, for me, being a white dude from Canada, of course, why would I ever want whitening soap? I mean, we're all like tanning, 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 you want to be tanned. Uh, give me some tanning oil or, you know, let's go in the sun, let's get uh, the brown, let's get burned, let's, let's get the tan. Uh, but here, in a lot of places in Asia, it's all about whitening. And again, each to their own. If anybody would like this 10 times intensive whitening soap, just message me. I will happily send it to you, maybe with a headband. So, great day in Kagiyan. Uh, Actually, I'm gonna be gone for a few days, guys, because um, somebody very close to me passed away, so I'm just gonna go visit the vigil um, in a different place. Uh, so, yeah, I'm gonna be offline for a little bit, and in the meantime, I'll see you in the near future. Power on. And ping, ping at, how long? Take care. The clock is never